M0FXB, welcome to my channel and we're going to just quickly show you how to program your Bofeng, whether it's the AAAS you can see here or the UV5 or similar radios. We're going to use the new, the new Chirp, so that's fun. So to download the new Chirp, you go to this link here and just click here, Chirp next, and it will install and when it opens, it will look like this window you can see on the left. So all you then do is go right click device manager find your radio that is obviously connected with the correct cable via USB to the computer and it will say something like this USB serial CH340 mine is COM10 yours will probably have a different number once you've gone we've done that just click radio download then in this section here just choose your port which mine is number 10 then we're on a Bofen, a triple eight here, but if you're on a UV5R, just select that, it's further down, just here, and similar radios. And then we'll just click OK, and it, if you've done it correctly, it won't say no response from radio, and you'll be able to do it. Let me just double check. All right, let's try it again. COM10, Bofen, triple eight, click OK. There you are, it's working now, just give it a couple of goes. As soon as it finishes, it will open up, and you've got your channels on your radio. And if, it, if it's a Bofeng UV5, you'll be able to add the names as well, because you can't add names to a Bofeng on a Bofeng. You can add memories, but you can't add names. Uh, but it's a lot easier using a program like Chirp, and thanks very much to Chirp and the team. So all you do then is just, we're going to add a channel. I know that we've got uh, only 16 channels here. So just delete the one that we've got, like so. And this is a 70 centimeter radio, but if you have the UV5, it will be two meters. So let's just add one. So we go 433.300. We've got a tone here, next line. Tone squelch, click that, choose the one you want. And we're using tone, not tone squelch. Tone squelch means it's really on the receive as well. And you're not gonna hear anything apart from the, the sound from the person talking. We're not doing DTCS or RX DTS, none of this. We're not cross moding. Duplex yet, yeah, you can set your plus or minus shift here. You need to put in your you know your shift frequency. You know, if it's a two meter radio, it'll be chances are it'll be 0 0.6 with all the zeros. FM, there'll be a blank space there for where you write the name as well, and you can choose your power. And when you've done that, you just write to radio, just click upload. Okay, and it's that, it's very good, chirp. And let's have a look and see if we go in the settings of this radio. So here are the settings, and there's not that many on this particular Bofeng AAAS, but you can see there are settings there, battery saver, FM function, alarm, ETC, and more. There you are, you've got a window here, and you can save, you go file, save. Now on certain ones, and I've had a look here, you can actually look at repeater book, but I've had a look. I couldn't see that we could do it here. Query source, repeat a book. And I think when it opened, it just it wasn't showing the UK. So I did drop down thinking, that's fine, I'll find UK. But no, Canada, Mexico. So maybe there is a way. But you could you know, possibly get a file and import it from repeat a book. Oh my God, look at all that. So I'm not sure where that came from. <laughs> so we just uploaded something from repeat a book then, didn't we? And it's all American, look. All American, so yeah, well, it works. If you just do that again and work out how we accidentally did that, query source, repeat a book, and we must have just selected what was on the screen and clicked OK. So if you got, a, if you're in America and you got a two meter seventy radio, then I would say um, perfect. Let's do that again. Query source. We've got. I've never used these other ones. Re radio reference. What's that? Never used that. Um, DMR mark, it's not a DMR radio. So that's good. Then you can import all these if, if you if you could import all these repeaters into your radio and it will be based on your area. So radio, query source, repeater book, let's choose United Kingdom. Let's choose a different area, Florida. Click OK. I go a bit too fast there. Let's do that again. It opens a new window each time. You obviously you can close windows. Look at radio, query source, repeat book, Florida, click OK. Wow, it's excellent actually, isn't it? I'm sure there is a way to get UK. And then you just literally write that to your radio. Now my radio's only got 16 channels because it's a boat, it's a, it's a triple eight. But if it was a UV5, it would probably hold up most of this. 
I will try it on another video. So yeah, excellent, enjoying this. Thanks very much, and um, we'll try it out with the Bofeng tomorrow. Bye for now, 7-3, and the link will be in the description for the new, the new chirp, 7-3. All the best.